smell. Trees on fire. The embrace. Oh god. Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Trophinet and welcome back to Horizon Zero Dawn. I'm being attacked! Um, I just fast traveled to the closest campfire I could access at the moment, but apparently the corruptors are already here. Holy shit! Oh god, 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 oh god. I can't get out of the water. Oh. I don't know where the corruptor is. Okay, fire bombs. Get by. There we go. Senora, you stand here. Anything to protect the embrace. But the gates couldn't hold. This is Hades future. Metal and ash. Yeah indeed, because this doesn't look good. And I'm no, I'm not out of health potions. That is okay. Let's take that one and just equip the full health potion. So yeah. Um, I was gonna do an introduction, but apparently that had to serve as my introduction. We're gonna continue the main quest, and yeah, the Nora are definitely under attack at the moment. Let's see if we can't help them out right here. Looks like there are still people alive over there. Unless they are... Oop! There we go! And in the face. Okay, so most people will be... Oh, shit! Okay. That was a genuine rea reaction. Didn't expect there to be a death ringer over there. Oh, my arrows are absolutely doing nothing. Rockets. Oh Jesus Christ, I don't think I need to fight everything here. There it goes. Oh, there's his weapon. It's off. Oh, can I grab that? Pretty immune to fire damage at the moment, so. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. There we go. Okay. Let's take all that, and then. Uh, I think I'm gonna try and move around here a bit more carefully. Because it appears like there's stuff all over the place. We need to head in that direction. For years, this this is my entire world. It can be destroyed in in hours. It apparently can, Aloy. Eh, We're gonna do everything we can to try and stop the them. On. I've never heard the embrace so quiet, so dead. At least I killed another Deathbringer. That has to count for something. <laughs> the old bunker. Where it all started. What if I'd never found that focus? Well, then you would have been 
equipped less than you were now, so don't worry about it, uh, Aloy. Seems like this is the only path to Mother's heart. Another defeat. The eclipse smashed through. Oh, I need to. These are collectibles. Sorry to change the mood a bit, but I need to smash those. I really need to smash those. I'm gonna quick save over here. And then I'm gonna see what I can do. Maybe I should go with triple fire arrow to start with. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There goes one weapon. Oh, come on, that didn't hit me at all. Oh, there's two. There's two. There goes one. Goodbye. Now I think I'm gonna go stealthy to take out the rest of these guys. Uh, maybe even swap over because I have equipped the Rattler, but I think I'm just gonna swap back to my... Maybe even uh, get some skills because I have seven skill points left. Um, let's go for Leader Strike now that we're facing the Eclipse. So death from below and then the Leader Strike. And then headshot after headshot. Don't need my precision arrows just yet. There we go. Show no mercy indeed. There we go. This does not look good. I'm just gonna scavenge around the bit. As these guys might have some health kits. Okay, continuing on. This does not seem easy at all. I hear something mechanical. Are they trying to. What the hell is that? I don't remember a metal devil being in uh, Mother's Heart. And there we go, corrupted scrapper down. Oh, come on. Ooh, that was in the face. From across the map. So let's just move, I don't want to waste too much time. Let's just head in there. Fuck stealth. Thunderjaw, right? The survivors must be holed up in the mountain. Oh shit! Be buried. I'll never reach the hatch. That is a problem. That's right. Bring down the mountain. Hmm. I'm gonna have to switch back to my uh, 
with my other bow as well, because I don't think the Rattler is going to help me with this. So let's do that. Let's swap back to the Shadow Sharpshot bow on the right. And see what we can do with that. Um... You dug your own graves, Nora! You'll be buried in there! Oh shit, that didn't do nothing. Is it? What the hell is going on? It didn't take any damage. Braves, to Aloy's side. Oh, now. okay then. For Aloy! For the For our mother! <laughs> okay, we got a bit of backup. This is awesome. Laurel and Sona, they're still alive. I wanted this launcher. I'm stuck behind something. Ah. Oh shit, okay, I didn't expect them to go for me. Because technically I was behind the... Uh... Oh, where's this weapon? Okay, this is gonna be tougher than I expected. Come on, get off, get off, get off, get off, get off, get off. Holy shit! May the goddess remember! There we go, on fire! Now starts dismantling it. Let's get the antenna off. And then the cannons. Get it off, buddy. Now I need to find one of those disc launchers. There it is. Oh, that bringer gun, that's also something. Ooh, ow. Oh shit. The corruption will not take hold. Where are the guns I took from him? Jesus Christ, where are the disc launchers? May the goddess remember! Yeah, on fire. There goes another gun. I'm gonna die. There's one. The corruption will not take hold. Over here, buddy. There we go. We did it. We did it. Aloy did it. We only helped. And that, now what? Now there's a freaking disc launcher. Okay. Out of all supplies, but uh, there we go. That was another corrupted. Luckily we had a bit of uh, a bit of practice on that for a corrupted thunder job, but that was awesome. Okay, who do I need to talk to? Aloy. Whew, Varl. reenact the old stories. Another metal devil struck down upon the slopes. If you hadn't returned, the tribe would have been lost. Yes, indeed. You saved the tribe. Did what no brave or war chief could do. I'm glad to see you're all right, Varl. You, 
are all right. Since the proving. So much death. Is the killing over? For now, but this was just one battle, Varl. There are more to come. I see. So long as we have you to fight with us, I suppose we'll make do. Hmm. Any survivors? How many survived the attack? Nearly all the matriarchs and many families, God be praised. But braves, just a few, and most of them are wounded. Never before has an enemy stabbed the heart of our people like this. Even the Karja, in all their red raids, never broke through to the embrace. Well, this enemy may have broken through, but they never got back out. We made sure of that. Okay, indeed, because that was one hell of a fight. Tell me about the attack. What happened? They struck from the east. Our sentinels saw the killers coming. Said that beside them marched deathbringers and corruptors and other machines, driven mad. We took ground, met them with clouds of arrows. Some fell, but they kept coming. Finally, we withdrew to the gates of the embrace to make our stand. But they were too much for us. Those who survived fell back to the mountain. So the survivors took shelter in the mountain? By law, only matriarchs are allowed inside. It was Tirsa who broke the taboo, ordered the tribe into the mountain for safety. Lanzra, well, she didn't agree. But I don't think anyone heard her over all the screams and shouting. <laughs> Tirsa's decision saved lives. Good for her. Common sense isn't always so common around here. Ooh, that was a bit of a burn. Are your injuries serious? Bruises pale. Bones heal. Don't give me a hunting song, Varl. Are you okay? My body aches. But it's nothing that will keep me from fighting. Okay then. And I'll guess we'll talk later. I need to go inside the mountain. And the matriarchs will be eager to see you. I'm sure. But I didn't come here for them. Then, what for? You will see. Deeper in the mountain, we need to go. Okay, let's see. Where's Tirsa? Bunker discovered Almol. Yeah, we, we kind of knew that already, but... We already found the power cell in here as well, so I am wondering if the last power cell is here too? Might be? Aloy. Oh, you've returned. Teb? Has that always been there? I'm not actually sure. It might have been, but I'm not really sure. Um, where's Teb? Teb, talk to me. Ah, oh, there I he is. Knew you would survive. Are you Teb? No, you're not Teb. Where is he? Oh, he's here on the floor. I'm glad to see you. Your injuries. Are they serious? A gash or two. <laughs> Nothing I couldn't sew back together with a needle and thread. Guess being a stitcher came in handy in combat after all, huh? <laughs> yes, I suppose it did. Okay, that was a short conversation. Let's continue on and talk to Tirsa and the other matriarchs. Oh, that was creepy. Uh, hello? Aloy! Tirsa? You've come back! So, you have finally returned. She not only returned, but fought her way through many enemies to reach us. Outside, she brought low a corrupted Thunderjaw. She lifted the siege. Thank you, Sona. How was this done? By the will of all mother. Oh, Jesus Christ. Have you returned to speak with the goddess, Aloy? Um, yes, I guess you could say that. I think it'll work this time. Sisters, surely we cannot permit this. Oh, can somebody because please her, shank her? Our tribe teeters upon extinction. What if she has come to wake her father, the metal devil? She means to finish our destruction. We must stop her. Um, let go of your fear, Lanzra. Ignore them and enter the hatch. You're not stopping me. Here Lanzra, we go. it's over. It's time to step aside. I'm not going to hurt you. If there's anything I've learned since the proving, it's that there are bigger evils in this world than you. <laughs> and brush aside. Finally. Now we need to find out how oh, we can override this. Error. Alpha 
Alpha registry corrupted. There we go. Correction. Alpha registry restored. How the hell did you even know how to do that? Confirmed. Entry authorized. Greetings, Dr. Sobek. You are clear to proceed. That was a pretty big payoff. That was nice. Whew. And I have a bit of goosebumps because of that moment. Back where we started. Even way back when we started. Since Aloy came from this cradle. Wait, where did that blue light come from? <laughs> if it came... Yeah, never mind. Because if, if that light came from in here, then why is it gone when I go inside? Yeah, never mind. Okay, I'm whining inside. again. Figured I might be hearing from you. Shall we begin? I never stopped. Okay, back inside one of these. Oh, wow. There is stuff over... Can I even scan? Nope. That was not what I intended to do. That was what I intended to do. I can't scan it from over here, so we'll have to see in a minute. Uh, yeah, okay. The only door then. Oh, I'm really curious what's about to happen. I feel like there's another plot twist coming. Oh, is that the last... The last uh, stranded thingy? Stranded figure! There we go. That's all three of the stranded items I need so for that set. This... Is where I was born. Where you were made. I'm not really sure about that. It might have been that um, so these that Elizabeth Sobek was pregnant at the time. Artificial wombs. The mothers of a new generation, hundreds of years ago. And me. So this was it. Where you were born. View the notebook. Ectogenic chamber B1001, birthing logged, task complete and standing by. But, but why? Yeah, why? That is indeed a very good question. Because there are a lot of those over here. Holy shit. Um, gestation? Spawning phase task complete, partial reactivation, standing by, viable zygotes in storage, zero. So Aloy was the only one to survive, if I understand this correctly. And I can't really see anything else, because I shouldn't probably jump down there. It doesn't seem like it's really safe. So let's go back in this main hallway. Hello? Keeps pointing us in that direction. I'm just gonna quickly scan. Another day has passed. You mean the lights got dim? I don't want to sleep, mother. I know, but it is time to get some rest. No, I'm king today. What I say goes. I want to see the real sun, not lights and pictures. You will in time, children. In time, in time, in time, in time. Okay, so the multi-servitor has died by now, but that kind of confirms that there were more children over here. What happened to those? They just die? Ugh. I have a feeling we're about to find out. This looks like a pretty big area. Nursery. Phase tasking complete, nutrient stores depleted. So they ran out of food. These look like cribs. The cradles of a cradle facility. And those things, the, the multi servitors, they took care of them. There was no one else. Oh, and those are toys. They look kind of weird, but. Definitely toys, so we came from over there, so the only place I haven't checked is over here. 
Although I can't really enter anywhere else, so... Let's get back to the main hallway. This is so cool. Um, maybe over here. Another dead multi-servitor. Someday, that's what you always say. We want it now. It's big down there. Now, father. Children, that area is not yet available. Get him! Physical aggression detected. Physical aggression is not permitted. Except yours. Damn sentinels! Children, may I be of assistance? Go away, healer! Lena, you have suffered mild bruising. Go away! Okay. So, oh. This says a lot as well. So, because they grew up and weren't allowed outside, they were kept in check by the servitors. But I don't know what this is all about then. It looks like something came and rescued them. Some blue shiny figure. That is weird. I'm going to check out the rest of the wall here. So yeah, they were dreaming of the outside world. It looks like... Nothing spectacular. And then there's more over here. Blue is the color of the sky. White is the color of clouds. Yellow is the color of the sun. Green is the color of grass. Flowers can be any color. Take a look. These are yellow and black, and they love flowers. Here they come. <laughs> Okay, sounds like normal children. Um, so this is where they lived. It's a mess. Everything's broken or painted on. How long did they live here? I think way too long. Children, let's run and jump and blow off steam. Leave us alone, father. After what just happened, I can't leave you two alone. You broke community rules. Just let us talk then. Go away. I'm sorry, children, but I must provide supervision. You're not even a person! You sound frustrated. Let's run and jump and go off steam. Okay, so understandably they became incredibly frustrated that they stayed in this facility. I wonder, did they wake too early then? Well, were they born too early? That's maybe a better, a better question. And we know from that first registry that the the food ran out eventually, so they might have just starved to I death. I have no choice but to release you. But why? There is no food here anymore. But there's uh -huh. food out there? We don't know for sure. Come on! Let's go! I don't know. Mother, can we come back if we're cold? I'm sorry, but that won't be possible. You will have to support yourselves now and take care of each other. What will happen to you? I will stay here and sleep and remember all of you. What will happen to us? You will be brave and you will learn. They were trapped here. Their whole lives. In plain view of luxurious space. What, what went wrong? Why couldn't they access the other areas? Unknown. But you won't have that problem. Wow, this place is actually pretty big. So yeah, why couldn't they access further? So they were eventually left out because the food ran out. And I have a feeling that because of the holograms, the, they grew up physically, but not really mentally, because they still sounded like children. Kindergarten. Multiple system failures, nutrient stores depleted again. Okay. Search the ruins beyond the hatch. Yeah, we're doing that exactly, so... Continuing on, we checked that one out. So, what does the rest of the wall tell us? Looks like they didn't like this door very much. It wouldn't open for them. Of course they hated it. Huh. That is very creepy. And it doesn't seem like... Oh, activate scan. Note for identity scan. Genetic identity confirmed. Entry authorized. Greetings, Dr. Sobek. You are cleared to proceed. Welcome to the Lyceum. 
a place of learning. Wait. No, Elysium was the, the place where the scientists were sent after they were done with Project Zero Dawn, not... So, what was this place, exactly? The dream of Apollo. Never realized. But why not? That is a good question. Because this indeed looks like terminals where they could learn everything that was stored in Apollo. But for some reason they couldn't. And there's a big shiny circle in the middle down there. I want to access Welcome that. Students. Please pick up a focus device and place it on the side of your head, just behind your eye. I had to dredge the pits of the world looking for focuses to repair. And here sat a trove, enriching no one. Yeah, indeed. Hello, child. My name is Samina. Today is a big day. Your first day of school. There's so much for you to learn. So much promise and possibility. Alert. Malfunction. Apollo offline. Apollo offline? You were right, Aloy. This is a graveyard. The charnel house of knowledge. What we might have achieved had we not been denied it. Maybe there's a way to fix it. But it's not why I came here. Of course. What's the whole of human knowledge next to the origin of one girl? Continue your search. Oh, oh no. silence. Please humor us for a bit. Um, I think this might be a good place to end it for now. I'm sorry I have to do this, but I'm going to have to take a little break. So thank you guys enormously for watching. When we get back, we're going to continue exploring the uh, cradle over here. And uh, I hope I'll see you guys in that next episode. So thank you guys enormously for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, don't forget to like it right here. And uh, well, see you next time. Goodbye.